Hey guys, today is a special edition of the channel. And why is that? Today we're going to look at a bag that's not even released yet. In fact, their Kickstarter just launched today. But the folks at No Reception Club, based out of San Francisco, have sent me a sample of their new bag. It's, the, it's called the Getaway. And what's special about this bag is that it's meant for parents. And as someone who has a young daughter, my daughter is only a year and a bit old, this was something that really interested me. And not too long ago, I wrote a lengthy article for Cariology about how I couldn't find a bag that was designed for parents that was good, that was high quality, had the features that I wanted, and would still be functional even after my daughter grew up. But the folks, at No Reception Club, Daniel and Gemma have created and designed a bag that ticks a lot of the boxes that parents are looking for when it comes to a good, efficient, high quality bag that not only has the features for a parent, but also will serve later on in life. So let's go into the bag and, and I'm going to link below their Kickstarter page um, just as a full disclaimer, I'm not getting paid for this. Yeah, Daniel and Gemma sent me this bag for me to try out as someone who has experience uh, as a parent and testing out bags for parents. They wanted to get my feedback and that's what I wanna do. I wanna provide some of my feedback, but then also go over the bag to show some of the features that they implemented. And some of the features that they implemented are actually very nice. They've taken an amalgamation of of different features from different bags that I really like and they've incorporated it into their design. So here we go. This is the getaway travel backpack for parents. Uh, very sleek, nice black color. I believe one of their stretch goals is to have different colors. But here we have the bag. You see right off the bat, you see you have a center opening for the pack. So here you have a key leash, a few mesh drop pockets. But what's also nice about this here is that you can actually open this up and it reveals center access. I can't use it right now because I'm using their shelving system, which we'll get into in a second. But if you're not using the shelving system, this opens up and you have direct access to the middle of the bag. So that's entry point number one. Awesome. Keep in mind about that entry point access for parents. So critical. You have the brain of the bag here with these two really cool buckles. I'm not sure what kind of buckles these are. I haven't really seen them around, but they feel nice. Uh, they, they, they're metal buckles, uh, really nice hardware. You have some vegetable tan leather trim uh, here at the top on, on the brain and then also in uh, the bottom as well. So good materials uh, as well. So you open this up and it reveals a cinch top bag. So entry point number two. So we'll get into that in a second. So under the brain, you have a quick access pocket for parents, something that you can put glasses. For me, I put my Skittles in here and glasses or wallet or phone, whatever, you know, anything for, for parents. And while we're back here, we'll get into the back panel. So in the back panel, you notice um, no air channels or anything like that. But what you do notice is kind of like this like quilted style material. Uh, it's comfortable. It's, it's nicely padded. It does have a frame sheet inside that does give it a bit of, of rigidity to it, which is nice against the back. Uh, I will say though that without the air channels, most likely you, you may get a sweaty back if you're like in a really hot place like I am here in Miami in Florida uh, You might get a sweaty back But if that's not something that you're you're really concerned about or if you're not really going to be wearing this for long stretches of time Then that's really like a, a non-starter uh, Or not not a non-issue here. You have a luggage pass-through That's really nice. And then there's also a, a little pocket um, for Like valuables uh, kind of like a hidden hidden pocket uh, for like a passport, valuables, things like that. So then we have the straps. The straps, I would say, they, you know, there's like, no like EVA foam, there's no air mesh or anything like that, but there is a, a, a padding here and it does have a, like a little bit of rigidity to it, which is nice. 
Um, I would say that this closely reminds me to the straps from the Wandered Provoke, uh, which is saying a lot because I, I always felt that that was a really comfortable bag. So nice straps, uh, nothing too crazy here. Uh, it's just, it's functional, it's, it's comfortable, even when uh, completely packed out. All right, let's go to the side here. You have a uh, water bottle pocket. There's a water bottle pocket on both sides, which is awesome. Uh, but here you have this side pocket, which here I have my daughter's diapers, but you could put anything in here. And then also something else you could put in here is aside from whatever you want, but with this bag, you can get it with their sling called the Sidekick. And we'll, I'll show that to you in a second, but the sling that I'm going to show you would actually be able to fit in here as well. But for my use case, you know, every parent is different in how they pack. Um, for this, I use it for, for diapers. Okay, so we'll leave this open just so you can remember that it's there. Uh, bottle pocket, got another bottle pocket here. But here, this opens up to reveal side access, kind of neat. And not only is it side access, but also the folks at No Reception Club have added a shelving system. So that helps a lot with organization. So think of it this way. You not only have access from the front, you have access from the top, you have access from the side, but on top of all that, then they've added shelving system which depends on how you use the bag. These are just options. They're not telling you, hey, you need to use the bag this way. They're giving you options on how to do it. So for me right now, the way I have this packed out, I have here in the middle, their Sidekick sling. And what's so cool about the Sidekick sling is that this is essentially for like a quick change. You need to go change diapers real quickly, you can do that. So here I have three diapers, a changing pad and cream. But well, here's something that's really cool about this, this sling is that it has a magnetic closure and you could put the wipes here. So if you're going to go to the bathroom, you need to change your, your kid, you don't need to take the whole bag with you. All you need to do is sling this over your back or sling it up front and just take this with you and everything is at your disposal uh, really quick. And like I said, this does fit in the side pocket. So real cool, real cool design. So also here I have, which you know, you can grab that from the top, but I have their little lunchbox. It's an insulated little lunchbox with uh, YKK AquaGuard zips. And I have two uh, Avent bottles, uh, which I believe they're also designed to hold two Komotomo bottles, which uh, we used to use for, for a long time. But little, little lunchbox, cool idea. And then at the bottom as well, I have my daughter's clothes, um, a spare shirt for me, a blanket, and some other things. So now you can see the shelving system. Uh, maybe you want just one shelf, maybe you use two, or maybe no shelves at all. And if you don't use shelves, then you can have that front access as well. R really nice idea, really nice idea. So let's close this up. Here at the bottom, you have what they call their emergency compartment. And why do they call it that? Well, this section has a, a lining that is odor resistant and water resistant. So if there is a blowout, something gross, uh, you can maybe just wrap it up, store it here and it won't affect the rest of the bag. And again, nice idea. Right now for me, I'm use, I have my daughter's boo-boo kit in there as well as some stuff that I don't really use that often. What's kind of neat about this is that it does share a bit of volume with the main compartment. So if you don't use this pocket, the main compartment sinks in. But if you do have it filled out, then you could see like this lining, this lining goes up into the main compartment um, so it expands and contracts as as needed. So really neat, neat bag. Uh, it, it serves a good function. The materials look good. Uh, and here's one of the things that I really like about it. One thing that perhaps you might want to consider. When I was testing out a lot of different bags as a parent bag, there were each bag had something awesome about it. In the Peak Design bag, I love the side access for the Peak Design bag. This bag has it. 
Mystery Wrench. Mystery Wrench, I love the fact that I can get to the center of the bag, the bottom of the bag, from the front without disturbing all the other stuff. Well, I could do that here. Uh, I, I tested a Topo Design Rover bag. I love that it had a cinch top, really easy to get to with one hand. They added that here. On top of that, two water bottle pockets, a luggage pass-through, and a pocket for valuables. And then also, I, I would like to mention, I don't know if you can see it here, they have some cool, like the lining is like this hand-drawn, kind of like cutesy design. Uh, I find it to be endearing, to be honest. But guys, look, this is the getaway backpack. Oh, and the last thing before I forget, super important, because this isn't just for kids, it's for adults too, the back panel. TSE approved laptop, tablet sleeve, uh, mesh pocket with a zipper. Also very good. Uh, so parents can keep their stuff in there as well. In terms of the materials, uh, the majority of the zippers here are YKK5s. There's a couple that looks like YKK3s. Um, the lunchbox has uh, AquaGuard uh, coating on top of it as well. So again, you have lots of access, lots of ways to store and organize your stuff as a parent. You also have the lunchbox and the sidekick sling. So, you know what? If you are a parent who is looking for a bag that, yes, is designed for you to go around with kids, but you don't want to look like it, you, you don't want a bag that looks like a mom bag or a dad bag, this just looks like a nice backpack, honestly. And if you want something that even when you're past having kids or and your kids have grown up rather, and you don't really need to carry around diapers and bottles and all that, this still has organization and features and functions that will serve you as an adult. Um, so anyways, like I said, uh, I'm not getting paid for it, but I do think that this is a, a nice bag, a great bag from people who are definitely passionate about caring and they are passionate about giving tools to parents so that they can travel more efficiently more effectively and be able to enjoy time with their family. So, hey guys, a special edition of, of the Traveler's Backpack Reviews. I hope to see you guys soon. Like and subscribe the video and also check out the link for their Kickstarter below. Uh, support a small brand to people who have put a lot of, of their money, uh, personal money into a project that they feel strongly about. All right guys, take it easy.